Well, on Memorial Day 2019, uh, we had some severe weather that was approaching uh, our area. The uh, tornado actually hit our area and it traveled through Beaver Creek before it uh, lifted off the ground uh, and went away at that point. It affected about 14 and a half square miles of Beaver Creek and over 12,000 properties within Beaver Creek. So it had a pretty major impact for our community. So that evening we spent most of our time assessing the damage and going basically door to door to make sure that everybody was safe and accounted for in the entire Beaver Creek community. The data exchange really started from the coordination efforts at the Emergency Operations Center, knowing which crews were in which map area. So we were able to send specific map sections out to specific crews to help keep accountability and make sure that we knew uh, where crews were working so that we could track them and make sure they were safe the entire time. That evolved into the damage assessment piece where we were able to actually take a, a data collector application and put it out in the field and partnered with FirstNet to be able to add some mobile hotspots to our existing cache of resources. So we were able to quickly collect the actual damage assessments in those areas and we were able to supply that to FEMA. Our decision to move to FirstNet for our data communications was based on some practical tests that we had partnered with the state of Ohio to do and were able to see the benefit of a dedicated public safety data network to help when we just can't have normal data access. When we're competing against consumers uh, for that data, we can't wait the extra second for that information to get to our crews or get to the hospital because those seconds actually count.